Hello, it's Sunny Guy 3. And uh gonna be showing you how to get the iPhone theme. Oh my god, they actually have iPhone theme for Windows. Who would have thought? I did it. How awesome is that? Okay. First you want to open your Internet Explorer or Google or whatever the hell you use as in search provider. Okay, so I usually use Google, but now I'm going to use Internet to show you the little thing that it does in the corners. See there? Change it red, green, shit. And you can also change it to like, I, I call it graffiti font. But it's called Hurry Up. You can see it. It like looks like someone actually hurried up and wrote it or whatever. So, you can put that font on there if you want. And now your crap will be like in a graffiti ish way. So, you either want to Yahoo search this or Google search this or uh, whatever search you want to use. And look up Windows. Windows blinds six point zero. Windows blind six point zero. And look it up. It should be searching right now. Okay, so it should see something like this. Windows blinds six point zero what is it zero or whatever. Whatever, which one you want to pick. So, yeah, you look up uh, Stardock. I mean, you should see sh uh, right, right here. Okay, right here. Either look up Stardock or Windows Blinds, which one who gives a crap. It's going to bring you to the same thing. See, this is exactly why I hate using Internet Explorer. Okay, here we go, Stardock.com. Okay. So now you're on Stardock. Skip all that. I just did it. Just go straight to Stardock.com. Okay. So now you'll see this page. Go down, and you'll see something that says My Colors. Click that. Okay. Now you click it. You can see a whole lot of different things. So now you want to click download right here at the top. All right. So you want to see it's going to be called my colors. If you want my colors, you should follow this. But if you want Windows blinds, you you should follow this. Go to home. Go to um, things. Okay, now go to uh, my colors. Here we go. My co my colors. I think this is the same as Windows Blinds. Not sure. So yeah, you want to download my colors. Wait. You want to download my colors right here. Back to downloads. Just want to show you something different. And download it. Once this is for Vista, so Vista users don't pout or get pissed off because it's for Vista also and Windows XP. So once you download that, my colors or Windows blinds, it doesn't matter. I use Windows blinds, but my colors is just as good. Go to it on, it should bring up an icon. Click your icon that you're using, that you're using right now, and go to click it. Okay. Okay, so you shouldn't see iPhone X unless you have the other pack, but you don't have that. So go to Add Visual Styles and go download from, you should see. You should click this first, right here, add visual styles. Then you should see a, two big boxes. Click the first one that says webcustomize.com. 
Once you click that, it'll load up a website or the website or in the customize.com. So once you're there, scroll down whenever my eyes pop up. <coughs> yeah. Okay, so there it goes. Windcustomized.com. And then there's see Windows Blinds. You down you download that, right? So you download Windows Blinds. Right here. You see something like that, Windows Blinds. And whenever you've downloaded it, go back to the website and look <coughs> and look at the top. See where the lizard is. Look at the top and look in the search panel and type in I Phone it. Spell it just like this. Spell it just like this. Wait a second. Spell, sorry, guys. Spelled it wrong. I P H O N I X. I Phonics. Phonics or whatever. So, you'll get one. You'll get one um, result, and that one result should be the iPhonics for Windows Blind. As you can see, it's right here. It should show a picture like of a little fish right there in iPhone it's V1.3. Click it, and it should say uh, download right here. See the little red box? Download it. I'm not going to download it because I already have. And it takes up a lot of space on my computer, but not that much. It's only two megabytes, so yeah, not that much. In is also good. This the users and Windows blinds users. So X out, and and once you've downloaded it, you should you should go right right back to Windows blinds, and you should be there. iPhone X theme. You might not see it as soon as you get on it. You might see it like this, and then scroll over, and you should see iPhonics. Click that theme, and go to the top. You click Animations. Now pick iPhonics. You see Settings. Click Settings at the top, to Task Bar, and you click iPhonics for each one. Now click Apply Changes, Apply Changes at the top, and Exit. You should see, I'm not going to change them because I already have, but once you change it, you should see like a little green box that says Other Snow, and the screen is like loading. So it loads up your theme, and it's actually that your theme. Easy as that. You can also add a little dock to it. Makes it makes it look cool. So yeah, that was how you get the iPhone X theme. And uh, uh, if you want to get the docs, I showed you on my other video. And you just check out my channel; it should be there. Sonic Guy Three. See you later.